What pain awaits us today? Who knows? See, hello everyone, and whoa! Welcome back to the walk. We've got mail. It's from Pri oh, <laughs> We didn't run out after all. She just staggered them a little bit. <laughs> all right. So it appears as if the letters have returned. I wonder if there's some, I don't know, some sort of trigger or something that causes them to to spawn and whatnot. Like maybe it has to do with certain amounts of progress or something like that, I don't know. But all I know is these have all been gold crowned except for that one and that one. So, the Glide Galaxy. The first one is ridiculously easy, providing you know where it is. Basically, you just dive as hard as you possibly can at the very beginning, directly straight down, and you'll get it. <laughs> like, it's really just that close to the beginning. So, here we are. You see it? Did you see it over there? Gotta go in the first person. No, I can't, but yeah, it's. Well, okay, you can see it down through there. So, alright. So, basically, just pound forward as hard as you can. I'm, I'm just gonna point it straight to the ground. <laughs> I'm pointing it right now. Here we go, and dive! Nailed it. <laughs> see what I mean? It's just. Yeah, it's kind of an automatic thing in that if you know it's there and you know you see it's there, you just die for it as hard as you can. And that's you know, the tolerance is right there so that you'll always touch it. Alright, one star <laughs> That was just like hardly even a star. <laughs> but let's go back in and get the second one, which is a lot more difficult because it's at a more obscure location. It's nearing the end when everything is collapsing, but uh, towards the left side, behind one of the smoke puffs that happen as, as stuff is breaking and falling down on the left side. So, it's, it's, it's kind of a doozy to get, especially since you have to play through the entire level to actually reach it. Every time, just for one attempt, but, well, let's do it. Let's hope that we get it. And let's do our best. We have no other choice but to get it. <laughs> it's, it's mandatory. <laughs> All right, going down, avoiding the other ones. I guess I'll grab the uh, mushroom if I can. There we go. Just to make sure that I'll have the health for any future issues that might happen along the way. And if you if you don't mind, I'm just gonna go ahead and uh, gently take ourselves around. Not like. Well, I said gently. I said gently. Well, jeez. <laughs> I, I didn't quite have the amount of turn that I needed to get through that, did I? No. No. Alright. <laughs> so, my car, having a good time. Yeah, I got it again. <laughs> uh, I wonder if it's, it, it'll give me easier if I just went around the right side. I doubt it, though. Well, maybe it will be. Cause then I can actually go... Uh, yeah, maybe that is actually easier to do in the way that I was doing it, but you don't have the the power of the dive to get through that then, you know, to increase your speed or something like that, but... Well, we're not in a race here, so who cares about the speed? Okie <laughs> yeah, dokie. Looking good, looking good. And uh, this is the point when you should be starting to look for said star. See this right over here on this side? Look! In the sm yeah, see it in the smoke. Yeah, it's nearing the end of this here. Can I get it? Can I? Yeah, I can get it. <laughs> okay, so I wasn't quite in the smoke like I thought, thought, but it was behind the pillar. So you do have a a good amount of time to see that ahead of time. But yeah, if you're looking where you want to go as opposed to at obstacles like you would normally be doing to avoid obstacles, you would miss that. But that's kind of the trick to that star, I guess, is to be looking all over for it. And gold crown. <laughs> Bowser Jr.'s Boom Bunker. Not to be confused with a sand bunker in golf. There's a lot more explosions than the kind of explosion shot that you would have in 
said Golf Bunker. So Green Star number one. And I could hear a twinkle going on right here. I think the first one, actually, you just shoot at uh, just out in the middle of space. You've got to hit it, and if you miss it, you lose. So did the Elio, but I don't remember where the second one is. We'll see, I guess. I'm just I'm gonna do my usual explore things. It is not broken. <laughs> I'm gonna use my ears to look around, even though it's not really oh I should have did a triple well that works too. <laughs> just to get that set up there, and then I'm gonna go in the first person and take a peek see around. I don't think there's anything back there, so I'm just gonna go on ahead here. Uh, I, I thought I heard something twinkling over there, that's why I stopped there, but yeah, this I do believe is the first zone over here. If you miss, you lose. You know, it's, it's one of those sorts of things who do not twitch when you hit the A button. I think I did twitch when I hit the A button, but it wasn't enough. <laughs> I got it. But was that one or was that two? I think it was one, because I think number two is at the moving platform segment, like where the black hole is. Somewhere around there, I thought. Could be wrong, no. Okay, yeah, that was number one, so... Voila! Da 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 da! And... Go! <laughs> Decent pacing going on here now, surprisingly, compared to certain other stars. <laughs> and... Number two. Da -da -da -da. Yeah, yeah, a prankster comet detected in Peach's underwear. Never mind. <laughs> go, go, go! <laughs> I don't even know what I'm talking about here. Actually, you know, I think that twinkly thing that I heard there was, uh, was actually at the second star, not the first star. Because remember, there's a segment between the betweens that was, yeah. So, I think that first twinkle that we heard during the, uh, preview here was indeed aimed towards the second one. Mm, come on. Come on. I know you're following me. There you go. Good boy. Uh, going just for the target this time. <laughs> I don't really have to aim for it, like the center or anything like that. Oh, I got it anyway. Whatever. Whatever. <laughs> uh, I guess I will go for said life up. Oops. Life up shroom. Probably. Well, yeah, I'll, I'll get it now. I was going to say I'll kill them first before I up my life. Because this refills my life, but eh, it's not that dangerous. <laughs> and I'll just do a couple jumpers over that. So there we go. Knock the turtle on its back. Classic, classic. Avoid the remainder of the doom that may, might be coming after you, of course. Alright, now this is where we should be looking for the next green star. I don't think it's going to be in this cannon shot. Uh, it might be, though. Let's just take a look-see. Mm. Yeah, I'm not seeing it around the, uh... the perimeter of our viewpoint here, so I'll just go for the target. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it's down below these platforms, though, so... Let's just take a look-see and see. Because remember, we heard the, the twinkle twinkles around this area for the uh, second one there. So... I'm just gonna go somewhere safe-ish and see. Uh, uh, hmm. <laughs> see, that's that's a, you know that's where it's gonna lead me to the boss. But hmm, where was that twinkle even located? This is not the twinkle I'm looking for, by the way. Of course. Uh, I'm just gonna take a gander around here, avoiding mines, preferably. Yeah, this is, a, this is a much safer one to look around on. <laughs> hmm. Just grabbing star bits like no one's business to... I didn't miss it, did I? I don't think I did. <laughs> I mean, this was the, the twinkle that I heard where the second one was during ye old preview. Uh, oh, okay. I see that. <laughs> where, where is that in relation to anything? Was that something that I was supposed to shoot at from the cannon? I think it was, but I didn't see that. But okay, so I guess I got another one to shoot at, cannon-wise, because that's easily too far away to get to via the power of the flower, so... Yeah, I knew I got my checkpoint there, so I'm okay. Alright, so what... Oh, it's way over there, huh? So I just didn't look far enough left? Okay. Oh man, this is weird. The camera's slightly moving. As I'm trying to aim for this one. 
Oh, man. Did I get it? I think I got it. It's looking decent. Uh, what? I don't understand. <laughs> I mean, I, yeah, I did miss, but it looked like it started saying too bad before I even reached the dang star. Uh, okay. <sighs> Steady as she goes. Let the camera drift in your favor. E. <laughs> Was that high enough? Was it too low? I don't know. Okay, I got it. <laughs> Okay, so, yeah, I just went a little too far on my run there to the next platform segment over, and I just missed it out in the sky. Okay, so you just shoot at both of them. <laughs> that takes care of another galaxy and World 5, for that matter. Yep, yep, yep. And next world over, then. So we're going... we're, we're getting to... End game, end game, end game here. So, <laughs> Melty Monster Galaxy is a go, and it's probably gonna involve me doing some weird jump over to some lava -y area that if you miss, you lose, sort of thing, or whatever. As usual, Green Star Worm. <laughs> so, let's listen for stuff. There's probably a green star on the first uh, segment of planets with the pole stars. Uh, I see one up next to that waterfall over there. That's probably not the first one. I think the first one is indeed uh, over here somewhere. Luigi's gonna show me to that pipe down below. So, meh, 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 I say. <laughs> I guess I could zip through here. It'll be a while before they pop on out again. Mm, yeah, I think. Uh. I think it's somewhere down below. I could be wrong, though. I'm gonna do this and just kind of, like, uh, catch myself. Okay, maybe it's not. Not down below. But I hear a twinkle coming. It's somewhere. <laughs> Let's go back and then forward and zip. Okay, there it is. Okay, so I gotta do that with those two instead of this one here. I'll get off of this one. And then, I guess, increase my momentum, zip along, as far as I can, I guess. Oh, it's not gonna cut it. <laughs> It'll t probably take me a few tries to maximize my momentum like that other one at the Booy Base Galaxy Remix. Especially since I've got a... Uh, got kind of a uh, issue with enemies going on along here. Uh, yo, let's try it with two stars spaced. Ooh. Yeah! Two stars faced across is the best way to go about getting maximum lift, I guess. Uh, the, I couldn't really do that before because the camera wasn't zoomed out there, so I kind of had to go forward and then back in order for it to be zoomed out properly for that move, but... Oh, there you go. <laughs> and two more to finish off the galaxy. The second one is definitely going to be the... Or at least, at least it's probably going to be the waterfall one. Well, lava fall one. And then the third one is probably going to be something after that, because, you know, the Lava Fall one is right after this first segment here. So, yeah. I wouldn't be surprised if the third one was on the bowling section. You know, how that you take that split path at the beginning? Um, when you, when you select the third star? Yeah. Yeah. Well, we'll see. That, I know for one thing, I'm going to have to get that one at the Lava Falls with the power of the Tornadoes. So, yeah, it'll be okay, I think. I don't, I don't think that one will be too difficult to get. It'll just be a matter of... semi-flawless execution, because there is a, there's a decent amount of uh, give that those segments, you know, the tornadoes have, so it's not that big of a deal or anything like that. Alright, this time I'm going for the launch star, so... I can just do it at these two here. Voila! <laughs> no green star there. I, I, I was looking. I was looking. So I'm pretty sure it's over there. So I, I think it's safe to hit this checkpoint. <laughs> I'm just gonna do this to save time. <laughs> Professional speedrunning tactics. And I'm even gonna grab that to make sure that I got a little bit of leeway going on here. <laughs> Uh, I probably use up a little bit too much of my leeway, but we'll see when, once we get to that point. Uh, all right. 
there we go. I wonder if I can skip on up there without having to... Uh, maybe I can. Let's just try for the fun of it. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah, it's doable. Can I skip this? Yeah, semi-doable. <laughs> I'm just messing around here, obviously. Checkpoint right here and all like that. Alright, so the star is directly above one of these falls here. I don't know which one will give me the best lift, probably this one here, because it's right next to it, so I'll do it at the very peak, and zip on over here. Wow, that's really forgiving. <laughs> Didn't even need my life up shroom, other than when I wanted to do my reckless, just skip through everything moves. <laughs> Alright, number two, I think that was number two, is done. So I, I do think the third one is going to be at the bowling segment, you know, when you're bouncing around everywhere. Probably. We'll see. <laughs> Hopefully it'll be something easier than the main star. <laughs> I don't know why I had so much difficulty with that main star, really. Green star three! Go, 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 Yep, bowling. Okay, we're going to take a look-see around here. See where we might be missing a star. I think I actually have to bounce back to get it, if I recall correctly. And you have to do it awkwardly with the camera in a fixed place. You gotta kinda hit it blind-ish. So it's probably gonna take me a bunch of tries if it's if it's the one that I'm thinking of. Uh, let's go for this. <laughs> I'm not really seeing anything during this preview segment here. That's okay with me, though, because it just means that it's probably along this area. And before I go on ahead with roly polies, I'm gonna take a look. Camera, camera, camera. Is it like, is that it up, up over there? It might be. Might be. Or that might be one of those things, those crystally things you break for star bits. Who knows? Oh, what? I'm just looking too far ahead and it's messing me up. Yeah, I think it was a crystally thing. <laughs> Alright, looking for the green star of death. Wherever it might be. I'm not seeing it yet. Yeah, I'm skimming though. And, oh shoot, oh shoot. Okay, I see it over there on the right side, so it is when you bounce back. So I gotta aim far right. Ah, that's gonna be a problem. <laughs> I mean, it's, it's near the end and everything. You've only got that one awkward shot at it. <laughs> Hopefully this will go decently smoothly, because it, it, it was really only that jump to the star that I had on, on my initial run through this place. And I, I will get a bunch of one-ups, I guess, uh, along the way if I just keep going down the center there. <laughs> now that I know where it is, so I don't have to look along any of the side routes or anything like that. So let's just relax and not not kill ourselves too badly here. Okay, I'm doing decently now. Let's just... <laughs> nope, missed. Ah! See, it's so blind that you can't really see how you are in relation to that one. So we have reached a seemingly bogus green star once again. How many attempts will it take? Who knows? Just hopefully I'll be able to get one up every t every attempt, so I don't have to <laughs> have to check back through too much each attempt. Uh, just as long as I don't die along the way each attempt too, because this is this is still a relatively dangerous track that we're going along here. In, in case you forgot, <laughs> so we still got ways to go per attempt. And going down, ah, I was too in front of it. So yeah, I'm, I'm trying to feel out what in relation it is, I should say where in relation to the platform it is. I can't really see, and I don't think it's really a good idea to flip the camera around, if it's even possible to flip the camera around. Like, let's try, okay, it is possible to flip it, I guess, but how will I be able to pull that off on the way back? Like, just after that one bounce? That doesn't seem like something super feasible. <laughs> That's a lot, a lot of multitasking, but maybe, maybe I'll give it a shot this run. See how things roll. Har, har, har. That's something our flubbery star friend would say. 
Okay, I'm gonna do this. Yeah! It is possible now, wait. <laughs> but I'm not, I'm not really sure the camera really helped me there. Maybe it did a little bit, but when I flipped it around so quickly, it was just super disorienting. <laughs> I guess that's a part of the quote-unquote challenge of it, question mark, question mark, exclamation point, ampersand. Yeah. <laughs> well, in any case, that's three galaxies, seven stars, and I think I'm done with this part. So I hope you enjoy, and I'll see you in the next part when we collect some more stars.